Hi everyone, Krista here with pk1homeschoolfun.com and I wanted to introduce to you the first printable in my printables pack for first grade math. So the first one is just a hundred chart. Now I know there's a bazillion of these out on the internet, but I just wanted to make one as part of my chart because it's something that every math student should have uh, when they're little working on their numbers. Um, and I also wanted to add these fun little goals at the bottom for learning how to count to 100 and doing all your skip counting. Um, I have this one laminated, so um, you can always just use a sticker when they've reached that goal. Or if it's just paper, you can check that off um, just for fun. Now, there's a whole bunch of different things you can do on a hundreds chart, obviously. Uh, we love using these little, um, I call them space markers. Um, I'm not sure what you call them when you're looking for them, but I do have a link on my page um, to the product on Amazon. But we love using these. They're just um, they're just super fun. They come in all a bunch of different colors, and um, you can pick a color and then just you know work on your skip counting that way, three, six, nine. Um, or play with them on a light box or whatever you want to do. Um, so we love doing that. And also my girls have collected all these different little tiny, we call them tiny toys, um, but Shopkins and Lala Loopsies and Minions. And so we love using these for our, um, on our hundreds chart. So when they're, this is especially helpful when they're adding and subtracting for larger numbers. It works like a number line um, we do, or you can even just use a dice and um, practice doing some number sense with that. Here we go, as a minion. Um, so I, I don't know, I'm kind of a nerd, but I love that, I think that's super cute. So um, that's another thing you can do in the hundreds chart, all sorts of different stuff. You can, um, if you've got it laminated, use your dry erase markers to kind of um, mark what you're using or the answer that you came up to. Um, also, if you have this saved on your computer, you can print as many as you want. I always print in draft mode when I'm doing um, stuff for school because I want to save on my ink. The reason not to. Um, and then your kids can color it. They can start coloring, you know, your tens and your fives and c color every third number. Just all sorts of things you can do on a hundreds chart. So this is just the first printable in my pack. It's just kind of one of those things you really need to have um, for kindergarten and first grade. And even second grade, you can do a bunch of stuff with it as well. So anyway, so that's just the first printable out of my If I Printable pack. And I hope you'll come back for the other four. And also, if you stick around, I have a really fun game at the end. There's some monsters trying to tell time, and they get in a lot of trouble. It's super duper fun. You'll love it. So come back for that bonus day. It's going to be a really great printable for you. All right. Thanks so much. I really hope this helps you out.